A lot of people falsely believe getting rid of arm fat is all about doing push-ups and lifting weights at the gym. However, you might be surprised to learn that tweaking specific hormones is a much better approach. So in this video, you'll learn six science-backed ways to do just that without needing to spend hours in a gym or suffer through restrictive dieting. I'll also explain how one particular mineral and a specific vitamin are also key to burning arm fat. We'll also uncover a specific approach that helped my friend Melody, a young mum of three who was very self-conscious about her arms, get toned arms and even drop a dress size in the process. And the best thing about it is that it was easy to implement into her busy routine. We'll get to her story later in this video. So if you're tired of hiding your arms under long sleeves because you're worried what people think, then this video is for you. And would you please like and subscribe? So. As we age, specifically from around age 38, our body's hormonal balance shifts. This directly impacts areas like arm fat. Imagine your body as a well-oiled machine. As we head towards menopause, it's like this machine starts changing gears, especially with hormones that affect how and where we store body fat. Up until our late 30s, the ovaries produce estrogen and progesterone. As you approach menopause, however, the production starts slowing down. Progesterone helps keep the stress hormone cortisol in check. So as levels of progesterone drop, cortisol levels rise, which leads to more fat storage. I'll explain later some effective strategies for keeping cortisol balance. But first, let's discuss how the drop in estrogen levels can lead to arm fat. One of estrogen's functions is to provide firmness to the skin. So as levels drop during menopause, skin begins to lose some of its firmness. This is why many women experience sagging arm skin during this stage of life. Furthermore, studies have shown that this dip in estrogen can lead to weight gain. So what can we do about it? One of the first steps to take is to include foods that balance estrogen. This can be done through consuming phytoestrogen rich foods, such as flax seeds and legumes. This is because they have estrogen-like properties, so can help counteract the decrease in natural estrogen, aiding in maintaining arm firmness and helping to reduce excess weight. There are also foods with unique compounds that help keep estrogen balanced. Examples of these are cruciferous vegetables, like broccoli, cabbage and Brussels sprouts. These contain a high content of special compounds called glucosinolates. When consumed, glucosinolates break down into other bioactive compounds that can help keep estrogen levels in a healthy range, thus helping to prevent weight gain and keeping skin firm so arms and other areas of the body will remain toned. Now, let's look at balancing cortisol. The adrenal glands produce cortisol and at higher levels as women start to enter menopause when their levels of progesterone drop. Higher cortisol levels, especially during menopause, can lead to arm fat. It does this because it increases appetite and promotes fat storage. Therefore, making sure cortisol isn't too high is important. To achieve this, we need to focus on supporting adrenal health, which in turn helps balance cortisol levels. And one effective way to do this is by ensuring you maintain adequate levels of vitamin C and magnesium. Vitamin C plays a role in the production of all adrenal gland hormones and can potentially mitigate the adverse effects of chronic stress on these glands. On the other hand, magnesium is essential for the proper functioning of the adrenal glands. It also aids in calming the nervous system, thereby reducing cortisol production when faced with stress. So what are some foods rich in these nutrients? They include leafy greens, avocados, nuts and seeds plus B vitamins, particularly B5 or pantothenic acid, are also important for adrenal health. This vitamin helps build cells, supports the growth and health of the central nervous system, and importantly, stimulates the adrenal glands. Aside from dietary strategies, low intensity exercise can be beneficial. For example, walking in nature for 30 minutes. And interestingly, a fascinating study conducted by Dr. Andrew Huberman found that cyclic sighing, a breathwork practice emphasizing prolonged exhalations, significantly improved mood and reduced respiratory rate more effectively than mindfulness meditation. This suggests that specific controlled breathing exercises can have immediate and potent effects on mental and physical relaxation, offering a practical tool for managing high cortisol and stress. Now, let's look at another important hormone for reducing arm fat, human growth hormone, HGH. HGH triggers growth, cell reproduction, and cell regeneration. It's crucial for maintaining a lean body mass, encouraging fat burning, and enhancing collagen production. 
Collagen is a key protein in the body and is a building block for skin, hair, nails, bones and ligaments. It also provides structure and elasticity to the skin, which is essential for keeping toned muscles, especially around the arms. Therefore, when HGH levels are at their peak, your body can efficiently burn fat while preserving muscle mass and skin elasticity. But as we age, the body starts to produce less HDH, making maintaining muscle tone on the arms more challenging. Think of HGH as your fat blaster and muscle toner. And one of the great ways to enhance its production is through high intensity interval training, otherwise known as HIT. Here's what sets high intensity interval training apart from traditional routines. Conventional workouts can sometimes hinder fat loss. They can increase cortisol levels in your body and trigger what we call the compensation effect. This is when you unintentionally consume more calories after a workout essentially negating the calories you've just burned. On the other hand, HIT can be completed in less than 15 minutes a day and is known to exert less stress on your body. What's even more interesting is how HIT can specifically target and reduce arm fat. You might find this surprising, but we'll get to this shortly. HIT is typically intense burst of exercise followed by a period of rest. For example, 45 seconds of sprints followed by 15 seconds of rest. A fascinating study published in Experimental Physiology in 2020 investigated the impact of high-intensity interval training on body composition in women, focusing particularly on those before and after menopause. The meta-analysis encompassed 38 studies with 959 participants, revealing that HIT significantly reduces overall body weight and fat mass in women. The study highlights that HIT programs lasting longer than eight weeks is a highly effective strategy for weight and fat loss in women. So how can this help with losing arm fat? Although some researchers say that exercising one area of the body doesn't equal weight loss from that area, there is evidence that shows you can target specific body areas to burn fat. A study at the University of Copenhagen looked at 10 healthy men and studied how muscle contractions affected blood flow and fat breakdown in nearby fat tissue. The results were fascinating. They found that there was an increase in blood flow and fat breakdown in the fat tissue near the muscles being worked out, compared to muscles that were at rest. This suggests that specific exercises might help with targeted fat loss in areas close to the muscles being exercised, a concept known as spot lipolysis. So experiment with doing pull-ups and tricep dips to encourage fat loss in your arms and be sure to give yourself rest in between to follow the principles of HIT. Doing this will naturally boost HGH, which is key for a lean physique and will also enable you to tone your arms. So, now that we discussed how lowering cortisol and increasing HGH can help to tone arms, it's important to discuss specific foods that can help do this. First off, consuming potassium-rich foods like avocados, sweet potatoes and spinach can help. This is because potassium is particularly important in supporting the adrenal glands, which can help keep cortisol balanced. Also, be sure to include quality proteins such as fish, chicken and grass-fed beef. Protein not only helps boost HGH, but provides the raw materials for collagen and elastin, two proteins that give your skin its elasticity and strength. Thus, protein can help keep your skin firm while shedding arm fat. Now, I want to share with you another strategy my friend Melody used that helped her tone her arms and go down her dress size. The key here is not only what you eat, but when you eat. Let me explain. Melody began by eating a late breakfast and an earlier dinner and then worked up to a fasting period of approximately 16 hours. This directly impacted her hormonal balance. This is because HGH levels increase during fasting periods, which, as we learned, supports muscle growth and boosts metabolism, both critical for reducing arm fat. This technique not only assisted Melody in toning her arms, but also interestingly reduced her sugar cravings. Consuming too much sugar can cause an overproduction of cortisol, which, as we already learned, can lead to excess fat storage. Now that we've learned how timing when we can eat can help balance hormones and help to tone arms, I want to let you in on a little known gut health secret that can have a significant impact on arm fat too. Your gut health significantly impacts skin elasticity and especially on the arms. The elasticity of your skin largely relies on collagen. However, for collagen to be effectively utilized by your body, it needs to be broken down into amino acids during digestion. If your digestive health isn't top-notch, 
you might find it challenging to break down collagen properly. This could result in less effective absorption and utilization of this crucial protein, potentially affecting the elasticity and firmness of your skin. One way to improve collagen digestion is to enhance stomach acidity. To do this, consider adding apple cider vinegar or betaine hydrochloride supplements into your diet. These can boost the pH level in your stomach, encouraging better protein breakdown and absorption. Additionally, ensuring you have adequate trace minerals like zinc, copper and manganese can help the body with breaking down proteins and collagen synthesis. By supplementing with these trace minerals, you're equipping your body with what it needs to produce and use proteins more effectively, ultimately aiding your skin's elasticity and your overall body toning efforts. Remember, achieving your body goals goes beyond exercise and diet alone. It's about understanding and optimizing your body's internal processes, like hormone regulation. By understanding these biological processes, you're empowered to take control of your health and effectively reduce arm theft. Although reducing arm fat is important, if you want to learn how to burn fat while you sleep, make sure to watch the video on the screen now.